Hi everybody, it's Miss Marletta, and we're going to do some more photo activity cards. And remember, our photo activity cards are real. They're real cards, they're a fact, and they're true information. So they're non-fiction. All of these are real, a fact, and true information. So, and they're all from the Frog Street curriculum. Let's begin. This is, can you see them both? This is an iguana and a noli. Both of these are lizards. The black and white one is called the iguana, and this is called the anoli. And the anoli has a throat fan. That's what that's called um, right here. And it moves back and forth. Do you know why they have a throat fan? Because it helps scare predators away. So if they think you're a predator, remember we talked about predator, predator in our last books? Something that might attack them or something that might eat them could be a predator. So, and so they flap their throat fan to maybe scare them away. And they do it to us because maybe they think we're going to grab them. And so they do that to us too. So they all, they both have a body and they're both different colors and they can grow up to be five to eight inches long. And they come in different colors and the different sizes. And they like to eat plants and small insects. It's interesting. We all know what this is. We see them all the time. It is a squirrel. One is a squirrel and one is a chipmunk. So they're both not a squirrel. And they both have bushy tails. See their tails? It's very bushy. And the chipmunk is smaller than the squirrel. And they both like to climb trees. And both squirrel and chipmunk, chipmunks eat nuts, worms, insects, fruit, bark, and bird eggs. Did you know that? That's what they like to eat. Our next one is a woodpecker. Some, some of you can hear the woodpecker outside because you can hear it pecking on the wood. And maybe you've seen them outside flying around too. You could see them. They have the red on their head and they have a very pointy, sharp beak. And they fly. They make a nest just like the other birds. And they peck on the bark. They peck on there and they find um, insects. It says that they can peck on the bark 14 times in one second. That's a lot of times. This is a fox. So the fox can bark, yelp, howl, screech. And fox are called cat-like dogs. Foxes are very smart and very cunning. Do you remember when I read the story about the gingerbread man? And who was cunning, who was very smart that was able to eat the gingerbread man? Was it the cow? Was it the old man and the old lady? Was it the goat? Was it the horse? Was it the dog? Was a fox. Foxes are very smart, and he's the one that ate the gingerbread man because he thought of a way to get the gingerbread man, and he did it. Our next one is a monkey. These are monkeys. These types of monkeys are called spider monkeys. 
because they have long limbs. Do you think these mon monkeys look like spiders? No, but they live in a tree and they can jump from one tree to the other. And they also sleep in the trees. Would you like to sleep in a tree? No. And look at the picture and see the baby monkey and his mommy. Do you think the mommy loves its baby? Look, he's holding his baby. Yeah, I think so too. And when they said they have long limbs, look how long their arms are and their legs. And that's why they're called spider monkeys. Ma, 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 monkey. Okay. Oh, what is this? A cat. I know some of you have cats. I know Noah has a cat. When I was on um, the meat classroom with Noah, he showed me his cat. And he told me his cat was calico in color. That's right. And cats meow. And sometimes they eat mice. And they have fur. This one is gray. They meow. Meow. They have paws. And they stretch. And they have whiskers. This is the last one. It is a whale. Let's learn about the whale. The whale is big. It's black with white spots. It likes to jump out of the water. It's a mammal. It lives in the ocean. And sometimes we can see whales jumping out of the water. Do you know that whales get 16 to 22 feet long? That's sometimes longer than our room that we're in. That's how big a whale gets longer than the room from one end of the room to the other. Depends how big your room is. Some of the whales are longer than that. Wow. And they can weigh 12,000 pounds. That's a lot. And they have 45 teeth. They have 45 teeth and each tooth is three inches wide. Remember our ruler? We were talking about how we measure with a ruler. One, two, three. So here's three. See from here to here, that's how wide their tooth is. Every whale, because we measured it on our ruler, three inches. Wow, they have big teeth because our teeth aren't even one inch. See, they're not even one inch. They're small. And one tooth is three inches. One tooth is almost as big as Miss Marletta's mouth. Look at that. One whale tooth is as long as Miss Marletta's mouth. Can you believe that? Wow, that's really big. But whales are really big anyways. So this is our last card. And they love jumping and swimming in the water. Well, thank you for listening again, and I'll see you next time. Bye.